Hello everyone, here's how you can develop for the new Spectacles 2024, also known as Spectacles 5. It's actually very easy, you just need to go and download Lens Studio 5.1. Don't uh, update to 5.2 yet, they explicitly said the Lens Studio updates are coming out much faster than the Spectacle updates, so uh, be aware of that. What we need to do is just to click on the Spectacles here, and we're going to load a template. Alright. Then... Let's change the view here to yeah. Great. So as you can see, we already got some examples here that we can with. They also work with the editor. And you see here, I'm gonna show you some more tricks, but for now, let's try to just disable the examples UI. Yep, the first thing I want to show you is. How do we use plane tracking and place things on the floor? So let's go to asset library and then go to spectacles and use surface detection. Great. Let's try to organize this a bit more. Also, let's switch the camera object to, or yeah, it's already switched to wall tracking, good. Okay, we drag, we drag this one up here, surface tracking, okay, cool. Uh, oh yeah, we need to assign the camera, I think, yep, so you drag in the camera here, and let's refresh, okay, so yeah, this is pretty neat UI actually, so that means when you log in on something or look at something for a certain amount of time, it will load in, great, so we got something here. Another thing I want to show you is how we can detect a pinch. And obviously if you want to manipulate this, you can just... Uh, let's quickly just show you how you add a sphere. So you just... I think I can just disable this one. Yep, there we go. That's our sphere. So yeah, you basically just... I don't think we need these two. So you basically just put it as a child of... Yeah. The example here. Great. I will show you how to do pinch. So let's search for spectacles. Documentation. Oops. Yeah, the SEO is not great. So let's go to spectacles.com. Let's click here. Developers. I'll try to put a link in underneath the video. So click on spectacles here. And. Spectacles Interaction Kit, that's also 
yeah quite important that all the other stuff like hand tracking and uh world mesh is not gonna work on the new spectacles so there's sort of like some new things to figure out here um but for hand i think it, or is it this one on trigger oh yeah here we go so here we got basically a script that detects when you pinch so when you when your index finger and your thumb are colliding with each other so let's create a script here let's use javascript because it is it's called pinch detection let's double click let's add it here also we need to add a scene object uh call it pinch detection we drag in a script here now i'll show you how to how i'm using it in my projects so yeah let's so we can just take a scene object here and it's the sphere that's in the scene and then let's create a new function called pinch detected or on pinch pinched we can then say script dot sphere dot enable equals false so this will um disable the the sphere in the scene not quite yet um we need to get this working here so basically we have two different uh methods here checking each hand so we'll just point both of them to to our new function but yeah as far as i don't know as far as i know can't detect pinch in the editor so um but this should work on the glasses yeah and then you basically just wanna yeah click here when you have connected your glasses um i highly recommend you use the cable because you're gonna save much more time some people tell me it's only like uh, seven seconds it takes um yeah but that's the tutorial hope you learned something and let me know if you want more of these